WJZ is live at 11. Paul Gessler joins us with a closer look at how the Jewish Community Center in Park Heights helped bring together families today with a focus on preserving peace. Paul. Kelsey, the One Park Heights Coalition had talked about postponing today's event, the festival, but instead they moved forward with it. Many with their thoughts on Israel and Gaza. It's the first of its kind fall family festival. We had musicians and story time and bouncy houses and fun carnival food. The One Park Heights Coalition aims to unite the diverse Northwest Baltimore community. To have something like this, to bring people together, to have fun for, for a day is, I think, really important. Important, Baltimore Jewish Council's Sarah Mickey says, for the festival to bring a day of fun. After a week of heartache, I've been on autopilot. You know, I know what my children need, but my heart is a thousand percent over there. Anna and Judah Weiss told us they talked to their oldest daughter about praying for peace. It's a terrible story from two sides. Their innocence on the Gazan side as well as the Israeli side. Baltimore based Catholic Relief Services Sunday sounded the alarm on the crisis unfolding in Gaza. Quote, calling for immediate humanitarian access to Gaza before a dire humanitarian situation becomes a catastrophe. Civilians in Gaza are entitled to safety and protection, whether in the north or south. We as a people have come together more um, to do acts of kindness and give to others. For many here, the conflict is playing out in their home. It's terrific. It's been a really, really awful week. And hopefully the next one will be better. The Associated Jewish Federation of Baltimore launched an emergency fund for Israel and Baltimore's sister city of Ashkelon. For now, reporting live at 11, I'm Paul Gessler for WJZ. All right, Paul, thank you. WJZ will continue following this story and what's happening right now in the Middle East. For the latest developments, stay with us on WJZ over at WJZ.com and on CBS News Baltimore.